everybody and welcome back to my channel my name is Lua responding to a few questions today questions that I've had sent to me directly or you know people who have asked me verbally via email and I'll be responding to them today to just introduce you to what my channel is about because I'm fairly new I know that I did a first video but that was just when I started off so if you want to find out what I can offer keep watching and um, the, the thing that I get asked the most is what is your niche my niche is being Lua I know that sounds really cliche but well I'm, I'm a busy mom I'll be sh I'll be illustrating my life it'll be more like family vlogs daily family vlogs when I when I started this channel I had certain things in mind the things that I had in mind are things that I've been asked and I've been doing in the background not necessarily via YouTube just daily so that was what I was focusing on however I am a family and lifestyle vlogger being a full-time job at my career having a full-time business by the side I'm juggling four kids a husband a mom myself and trying to stay fabulous trying to to keep healthy the niche which is specific to the family um is our son our big boy our two boys actually play football and our bigger boy plays slightly more formal football which i can actually say almost takes over most of our activities in our life daily the next one is what made me what 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 spurred me to to have create a youtube channel this is long overdue okay um, a couple of years ago, actually three and a half or four years ago, when things just started getting really, really busy for us with Tristan, I, and a lot of people kept asking questions, how do you do it, what's life like, um, what advice would you give other moms, and I went ahead actually at the time, because most of the interest was because of Tristan, I went ahead and actually opened um, a YouTube channel, but for him, everything just overwhelmed me, and I could not carry on, um, young boys and girls alike are showing talent in not only football there's rugby there's volleyball there's there's basketball there's tennis it's just you know giving our experience what we did with tristan and that might impact or help another family not sure how to go about things so i'm okay to share my life with people um at the time i was still guarding i was not really in this mind space um are you only focusing on weight loss no 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 so weight loss this is my first topic was due to popular demand so with my weight loss journey how i've been big small and in between and how i always share my healthy meal taking my walks and just keeping on top of things it's not focused like a topic it's a lifestyle so i want to show i'm not the most i'm not going to portray myself like the most healthy mom i try like we all do and I want that to be clear that I am a normal curvy woman who's trying to be on top of her weight. But there are a lot of people that I've helped out there. A few of them might want to comment under this post to maintain their weight or lose weight. So why not why not do this through um, a YouTube channel and get to a wider audience? So but it's not my only focus. What's my next topic? right so i don't i'm not going to be taking topics like weight loss per se if there is something that you want me to talk about something that relates to everybody feel free to text me but i will have a session on particular football so i will be answering a few questions on how um to encourage and how we manage to juggle with work and um, with tristan so i'll have maybe one session on that if there's anything in particular feel free to always text us seeing a lot of vlogs very exciting stuff coming up just wait and see okay right um is that like how is it like to be a busy mom of four i don't know i should be asking all of you moms if you're a mom watching me exactly how you juggle it it's hectic it's crazy chaos fun and madness all i love being a mother I love it and I, and I always joke that if I did not have difficult pregnancies I probably have about 10 children now I don't know what it is like without you know without having them in my life because I've had them I think I've grown up with them and um, so yeah things will it be just yourself or your entire family I mean, I'm not in isolation at all so it'll be myself my husband every now and then kids the other boy with the little girl the fun the non-happy the happy times everything okay I'm sure I've, I've gone I've gone a bit off topic there but yeah um the next question is about to say is is it 
just about me? No, it would be my entire family. Yes, my kids think I'm crazy. They find me hilarious sometimes, but um, they have to deal with it because I'm their mother. How does it feel like, like having your son playing and how does it affect the other family and the other kids? That's like four questions in one. <laughs> Let me start with this q and I'm going to release a day, a typical day in my life, which I filmed a few weeks ago and that depicts it's it depicts a, a typical day it shows emotions it shows madness it shows happiness it shows hell just full of ups downs and it's so typical how our day goes most times that was probably it couldn't be any better a day i just picked out and that is is going to answer most of these questions i've had today the other part of the question is how does it affect the other kids we try to make sure the other kids are involved in other activities so not only tristan axel as well our second boy plays football and we try to make sure that he enjoys the game and is not under any sort of pressure because he's tristan's brother and he's doing really well he's actually very talented as well so we, we keep him phoebe our other daughter we try to keep her she wants us she's finally decided to enroll in a football team so we start with her we've tried to do other things she does she's not she's really really a tomboy and the little the little girl just rules the family, so it takes all of our attention. Um, lucky for her. I use the word try loosely, but I think I've succeeded actually. Still being sane, if this if I, if this is what you call sane. Will you venture into gossip blogging? No, it's not for me. It's not for me. I, I don't know how to gossip. I can maybe <laughs> some people might disagree. <laughs> anyway, I I wouldn't be in a position to gossip openly. I just don't think that anybody has the right to necessarily gossip about openly about anybody else struggle but maybe in the future when the kids are grown up i might bite my words watch this space but yeah i doubt it but not for now no much interest in weight loss somebody has said the same thing and i answered that already um but just to add that it's the same as as in inspiring young people so um i try to mentor people by the side young people who young africans young cameroonians who come um, like I did and we all, you know, do daily, try to make a, a, a decent living. If I had, if I could turn back the hands of time, I'll do things so different. And if, whenever I meet young people, young, uh, you know, young Cameroonians, young Africans, in, immigrants, I try to impact them positively. I, you know, I try to give them advice because I was there a few years ago, not so long, but things have changed, I know that. And they're a lot more savvy so i'm not only interested in weight loss i'm generally interested in inspiring mentoring people and just generally adding value to people's lives and networking as opposed to so i will not just talk about i can chit chat i'll be doing a lot of chit chats on topics that you know affect us daily that i can contribute positively to that's the word but if i don't have anything positive to impact or I would not talk about yes that that's it for today if you've got any more questions send to me um I'm glammed up like this today I'm normally not this glam but I had um a photo shoot today so um I just thought why not I'll just answer these questions I've been having because I look I look glammed up if you're interested in family vlogs lifestyle I'm a healthy eating enthusiast who is a foodie and loves to binge sometimes if any of that interests you, subscribe and turn your bells on so that you're the first once I release a video to be notified. And for those of you who keep returning, thanks for always stopping by and be prepared for much more fabulous stuff coming your way.